Hey guys, let's get straight into the good stuff. I'm test driving this baby you see here. It's the Impulse Far Infrared Styling Iron by Devol. It has five heat settings and I'll be setting mine to 360 degrees Fahrenheit. That red light you see is their infrared technology. It claims to use gentler heat that deeply penetrates and evenly distributes heat resulting in less damage and frizzy hair. All of the specs will be in the description box for you to check out. I will not be putting any heat on these parts that I have sectioned off. And I did apply heat protectant right before I flat ironed each section. You guys probably can't tell, but my hair actually did get straighter and smoother using this iron compared to other irons, especially my ends. I always use irons on 360 degrees in one pass, so this is pretty straight dealing with the limitations that I set. So you guys, I'm not just straightening my hair to review this iron. I needed a smooth base for this bridal hairstyle that I wanted to try. And yes, you heard me correctly, I did say bridal. I just got engaged a month ago, so I definitely have a lot of events coming up. So I'm trying out different styles because I will be doing my hair myself for all of them. So obviously I already tried out the style because this video is old, I'm just editing it right now. And the style, it just wasn't me but you never know until you try. So with that being said, all of my kinks will be present for all of my upcoming bridal events. Okay, not to get super repetitive with the video, but let's just skip to the end. All I did was put on my white robe so that I could see my ends better. Just in case you guys forgot, one third of my hair is still braided and pinned up underneath this hair. I cannot believe that I have this much volume with that much of my hair out of the way. So for those of you who don't know, my texture is looser back there and applying any heat to that part would make it even looser, which would jack up the shape up haircut that I just gave myself about three months ago and we don't want that. So we're just gonna leave that part alone. <laughs> you guys I just popped up really quickly to show you guys that I don't have any heat damage my hair has completely reverted I just put a little bit of water and conditioner in it and let it do its thing basically and this is what I got this is so cute to me I love it just natural the way God intended and this shape oh my goodness y'all this is the shape that I have been wanting and dying for this shape right here is something that I inspire to be like this is goals but yeah anyway you guys I am not gonna lie I actually do like this flat iron the only cons I have about it is that it only has five heat settings and I'm used to using a flat iron with the digital dial that I can tune up to whatever I want to the degree. But yeah, this only has five. I'll probably only be using the first three settings on here. I might get the guts to use the last two settings, which is 410 and 450. Maybe one day, maybe one day, but not today. This heat is not the enemy, but you definitely need to only treat it as an acquaintance. I know a lot of you are looking at me like, will she put those flat irons down because you know my situation for my new subscribers? I'll link the video of my heat damage below if you want to see it. But honestly, that, 
was because I let someone else flat iron my hair and they fried the heck out of it. All the times I flat ironed my hair before then, I was just fine when I flat ironed it myself. But it, when I handed the flat irons to someone else, that's when I had damage. So I'm just going to keep it between me and my hands for the rest of life. I will never ever let anyone else flat iron my hair unless I don't care about getting heat damage. And you never know. It might be a day where I'm just like, I don't care. I just want to do my hair whatever way I want to do it. Heat damage color, whatever. I might just want to enjoy my life YOLO. But that day is not today. So as you may know, if I have not said already, this flat iron was gifted to me by them. They just wanted me to try it and I did try it. All of my opinions are honest because I'm not getting paid for this. You know, it's not a sponsorship. They just gave it to me. So I really can say whatever I want about it. And I actually am going to use this over my other flat iron. I'm not gonna expose the name of my other flat iron. You can just look at my flat iron video before this one. That will be linked in the description box below as well. Out of both of those flat irons, I would actually pick these up just because I don't, it gave me a smoother finish without having to dial up. Like I use this flat iron on the same exact setting that I did my other one, which is around 360 and my results were smoother with this like it wasn't bone straight but it was definitely you could tell the difference so you guys the vogue gave me a coupon code you see that like i'm moving up in these streets like people giving me coupon codes okay all you gotta do is type in asia shar and you get 70 percent off for this and that makes that let me do the math that will make this flat iron 58.50 if you really want a a nice flat iron you can go ahead and try it so just to be clear i'm not telling you guys to go out and buy this flat iron you can use the coupon code to get 70 percent off whether you use the coupon code or not none of those coins are coming into my pocket i'm just letting you guys know that there is a coupon code in the description box so with everything that i know about this flat iron and using the 70 percent code please use the code i would definitely buy this with my own money and i am very cheap just saying i am very cheap with my money now buying this for the original price i probably would not but with the 70 percent code i would definitely snatch this up so if you want to know more about this flat iron i will link all of the specs in the description box maybe i'm just choosing but i'm about to be somebody's wife like like you guys it's so crazy saying fiance or that i'm someone's fiance like it's so awkward so for all of the events that go on with a wedding like a bridal shower bachelor party the actual wedding or pictures or whatever i'm gonna be wearing my hair natural and i'm gonna be doing it myself of course if some of you guys want to see it a little better hold on, let me see it's so beautiful he got exactly what i wanted something simple i definitely wanted something simple no extra little diamonds or stones in the band i wanted a simple band in a princess cut solitaire style diamond and that's what i got it is so cute so i can't think of anything else to say so i hope you all enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys all in another one bye